Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Pisces. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of March. Okay, so we're just going to see what comes up from March. Uh, you may be watching this in February, and some of it may resonate then, but I would urge you to watch it in March. This is a preview of what's to come. So what do we have for Pisces? What do we have for Pisces? Well, great worry over nothing. So you're worrying about something that you shouldn't be worrying about by the looks of things. Camel, persevere and you will overcome problems. So there's some sort of perseverance that is needed. Um, you are going to overcome something. Stop worrying about it. You need to stop worrying about something. Get rid of one of these. I was going to say, let's get rid of this. So I don't know if you need to get rid of something. Because I was going to say, let's get rid of this. <laughs> Whatever that means, I don't know. Must be you got to get rid of something. Um, once you do, all your worries will be over. What do we got for Pisces? Ah, the Magician card. So this is a divine connection to Source, right? So Magician is a card of awareness. It is a card of manifestation and power. So it looks like you have a lot of power this month. You're probably going to be right in your power. You're going to be manifesting something. You're going to be taking action, creating something. Um, the magician is willing to do whatever it takes to bring success. So I feel like this month you are going to be successful in some endeavor. You are. I feel like you have the power. The pow You have all the power. The power is in your hands, right? And there's a divine connection to source with that card. You can have whatever you want by the looks of things. You can. You have, a, you have everything you need to get what you want. But the magician has to take action. To get what they want so you may have to take action in some way and I feel like this month you're going to be because that's what the act the action does that's what the magician does the magician takes action is willing to shed the old to bring in the new so I feel like you're gonna be shedding something and bringing something new in now the magician is a card of oneness a card of self and power so you are you're and it's an awakening of some sort as well so you're going to be in a very powerful position this month by the looks of things you could also be dealing with a gemini you could be dealing with somebody that is very powerful as well i mean magician does represent gemini which is a, a very action oriented energy manifestation manifester very skilled so somebody has all the skills they have everything they need to be successful stay optimistic about your love life positive thinking will bring in faith will bring you romance now this is a card of manifestation and positive thinking kind of the same thing okay your thoughts become things your thoughts become things so you're manifesting something make sure you are thinking positive because you like I said your thoughts become things if you think negative you know, like all your worry, then that's what you're manifesting, okay? You got to have faith, think positive. You can have whatever you want. So what do we have for Pisces? What do we have? March. Communication, action, things moving very, very fast. This is fast forward movement, good news arriving. It's triumphant news. This is also the rods of love. So there is going to be some good news that is arriving. You may be messaging with somebody. It leads you in a very positive direction. This is very positive energy. Things moving very, very fast in a positive direction. Put it that way. Six of Wands reversed. Now that is a victory after sorrow. 
So somebody has been fighting, okay? They have been fighting, they've been in a battle, they haven't been making much progress, um, there's a lack of confidence, there's some sort of fear, somebody has been fighting, could be somebody that is very egotistical, somebody has been up against their ego, sitting on a high horse, um, not cooperating, this is a loss of some sort. You've, uh, somebody has experienced a loss. It's because they didn't take action because they were fighting. They were fighting and they maybe have lost some sort of support. But now it's time to take action. So action is definitely being taken. Action is definitely being taken this month. After there's been no progress. This is no progress. This is a loss. It's a, it's a loser. You know, this is losing something because of ego, because of pride or inexperienced, we could have somebody here that is inexperienced that hasn't been communicating or hasn't had faith or has had a lack of confidence or something like that. Ooh, nine of pentacles reverse, unstable. So the nine of pentacles, you must take action right now. Somebody needs to find their discipline. Somebody needs to find their discipline. They need to uh, put in more effort. They need to work a little bit harder. There could be a loss of money, a loss of income. Um, there's going to be some sort of epiphany or realization as well. By the looks of things, we have somebody here that doesn't have a lot to offer, that isn't really stable. Somebody may be losing something that isn't, it doesn't appear that it's very valuable. Um, there's a lack of value, lack of worth. We have somebody here that uh, isn't very self-sufficient, you know, isn't very stable, which is interesting. There's going to be some sort of change, though. Ooh, Five of Swords. I hate that card. Oh, my God. So the Five of Swords, that is uh, <sighs> defeated. I do apologize. I, I do have things for the windows. They just haven't come yet. Anyhow, Five of Wands is a battle, it is a conflict, it is a fight of some sort. You you could be getting in a fight with somebody this week, or an arc, or did I say week? I meant to say month. This is um, some sort of lose-lose situation. It is a lose-lose. This is a lose-lose, and this is a lose-lose. Somebody is involved in a lose-lose situation with an individual that is unstable and insecure by the looks of things nine of pentacles reversed that is you must take action to protect yourself or to do what's right for you if somebody needs to do what's right for them they may need to walk away from something you see before they get hurt i mean you notice one person is you got two people on the ground over here we have somebody here that likes to fight obviously this person wants to win at all costs they don't care who they hurt Ah, and there's grieving. There's grieving over a loss. We have somebody here that is definitely egotistical. We have it in these two cards, this card and this card, that has lost something. They have lost something. And now they're not happy by the looks of things. But anyhow, Five of Swords, that is a very egotistical individual who is emotionally unavailable that is hurting people. Somebody is hurting people. It's because of their own insecurities. We have somebody here that wants to win at all costs. It's because they are insecure. It's because they are insecure. And there's no victory. There's no success. This is no victory, no success. This is somebody who likes to fight. We have somebody here that, that just like is, is so insecure that they want to fight all the time, which is interesting. Eight of Wands. Now that is fast forward movement. Taking action, doing whatever it takes, an awakening. If somebody is getting a wake-up call, they are getting a wake-up call of some sort. This is betrayal. Somebody is trying to prove something. They're trying to prove their, their value or something like that. They're trying to prove their uh, status. We have somebody who doesn't care who they hurt as long as they're on top, as long as they're the winner. 
but this is a loser. <laughs> Interesting. It is a loser. So we're dealing, we got a loser here that is uh, very, very unstable. Interesting. Removing an obstacle. There's an obstacle that has been is being removed. There's been some lies. Somebody has been lying about something. They've been lying about their stability. They've been lying about their security. They've been lying about their, uh, I don't know, maybe about their job or about their money or their financial status or whatever. There's definitely been some lies or they've been lying about being in a maybe it has to do with a relationship because this has to do with independence you know maybe we got somebody here that just wants to be alone and they've been they've been uh lying about their feelings i don't even see feelings here <laughs> you know so there's like there's somebody hasn't been expressing their feelings at all they've been they've been hiding their feelings anyhow uh, this is breaking free from a situation being broken free some of you may be becoming single you know, you may be, somebody may be walking away. They could be leaving. There's been, there's been too, too much fighting. There's been too much belittling. It's been a lose-lose situation. Whatever is happening, there's going to be movement. There could be travel going in a new direction this week. Somebody could definitely be becoming single because there's, you know, some sort of, I don't know. I mean, right here, it looks like somebody's done. Right here, this person's done. I don't think they're getting up by the looks of things. Anyhow, um, and there's grieving over a loss. So I'm not sure if there, there's obviously a loss because this is a loss, losing a battle, losing a fight. Somebody, there's. I feel like there's going to be some sort of loss. But this person is very, very smug. It's like I don't care. I don't. I don't care. You know, this person doesn't care if there's a loss or not. It's all about financial stability. This is somebody that is very greedy and egotistical, 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 and all it's about about breaking free. There is some sort of freedom that is coming this week. Freedom from an egotistical individual that just wants control, that just wants to win at all costs. So anyway, there is some sort of freedom. And I feel like you really need to think positive. This may be a blessing in disguise. It may be. Um, this is like, I have, if somebody doesn't have any fight left, it's like the, it's over. Um, this is an obstacle being removed that you have been tied down with, that you've been tied to, that you have been, uh, it's over, whatever it is. I feel like there's going to be positive change, positive movement. It is positive, believe it or not. You're going to be broken free from some sort of shackles by the looks of things. And you're, you know, you may, you may, uh. And maybe you're going to be happy about it. I don't know. Um, King of Swords. Now that's challenging information. Or you're dealing with somebody. Or you, you are. I don't know. Somebody right here is very cold. They're very. It's not. It's not about the feelings. Okay. It's all about logic. It's all about uh, facts and. Um, Ideas. Now, the King of Swords is somebody that is very decisive, that makes a decision based on logic. And we have that Five of Swords there as well, which is a, a some sort of fight. I feel like we have some sort of challenging information. A decision is about to be made, and there's no going back. There's no going back. Whatever that means, there's no going back. This is a final decision. Yeah, I feel like there's a final decision being made. An obstacle is being removed that has... Uh, caused somebody some sort of mental turmoil. That's 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 over. It's over. The battle is over. Whatever that means. Done fighting. You win. You win. Anyhow, um, King of Swords. This is somebody that is in a position of authority that is making a decision based on the facts, based on the truth. There is somebody here that may have been in a situation just for financial independence, you know, but they weren't in it for love because I don't see any love in these cards. There's no love here. Where's the fucking love? Excuse my language. Anyhow, that slipped. Anyhow, love is what matters, not money. Anyhow, we have somebody here that uh, is making a decision and action is going to be taken. Action is definitely going to be taken. Um, 
there is some sort of freedom. There is freedom with the Eight of Swords. Somebody may have been asking or because when I see the magician card, that's that's like as above, so below, you get what you ask for. Somebody may have been asking for freedom. Because this is freedom. You know, praying for freedom. And this is triumphant news or news arriving that gives you what you asked for. So you somebody's gonna be getting what they asked for. Somebody's, uh, I don't know. It looks like we have somebody here that is making a decision based on the truth, based on the facts. That's what it is. Somebody's making a decision based on the truth. We have one person here that is very, very unstable, that is insecure, that is money hungry, that is controlling, that is manipulative. We got somebody here that is very controlling and manipulative. And they've been keeping a person tied down. But now the obstacle is being removed in some way. This is some sort of loss. It is. But it, but this loss leads to the end of a battle. Okay. There's no progress being made anyway. There you go. Ooh. Now, if there's any, any legal things going on you know when you get the justice reversed there's 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 an injustice here somebody something may not be going in one's favor with the justice reversed if there is news of legalities somebody may be getting some news that you know uh i don't want to hear somebody could even end up in prison i hate to say that oh my god anyhow um Justice reverse. There's, there's there's unfair treatment. There's been lies. Somebody has been lying. Somebody has been lying about something. Lying about their stability. They have, and the truth is going to be seen very very clearly. We have betrayal here. This is admitting defeat. Somebody is going to be admitting their defeat, and they're going to be walking away. Anyhow, justice reversed. There's an injustice. There's unfair treatment. Somebody didn't get what they deserved. And there's probably some sort of karma that is coming. Somebody could be losing something of financial value. You know, I mean, the nine of pentacles reversed. Nine of pentacles upright business owner that is successful. And reversed, it's a lot, it could be a loss of a business or a loss of financial success or a loss of revenue or a loss of something of financial value, okay? And it could even be a person. It could be a person that brought financial money to the situation, you know what I mean? But it's a loss of money, put it that way. That is a loss of financials, whether it's you or somebody that you're dealing with, whatever it is, um, there's been an injustice. Somebody has been not treated very fairly and they've been lying they've been lying but they're dealing with another individual that is very very intelligent this person is you know a protector or it could be a judge it could be somebody in protection services it could be a lawyer it could be um anybody that is very very intelligent a professional okay we have somebody here that has some sort of truth or information that sees the truth it sees the lies. Somebody is going to be seeing some sort of lies. And we have somebody here that uh, is probably not going to be happy with an outcome by the looks of things. This is unfair treatment. Bad karma. Somebody is going to be getting some bad karma. I hate to say that. I mean, I don't wish that on anybody. Trust me. So, but the... You know, this is a, a serious betrayal. We have somebody here that doesn't care who they hurt. Don't care who I hurt just as long as I win. So, you know, this is somebody that wants to win at all costs. And they are about to lose something of value because of that mentality. And that is mentality. So, somebody's about to lose something big. They are. Uh, justice reversed. Unfair. This isn't fair. Something isn't fair. 
there's an imbalance here. We have somebody here, and they may be mentally imbalanced. You may have somebody here that is mentally imbalanced, and it's very, very clear. Anyhow, um, Pisces, I feel like there is a battle that is going on. Something is not going to turn out. Something is not going to turn out, or there's been an injustice, there's been some sort of lies, but it's going to be seen very, very clearly. Um, I think there's news of legalities this week. I, I just got to be honest with you. Somebody somebody could be rushing in, you know. I, I, I hope that's not the case, but I'm just saying. Um, action is about to be taken. There is a loss of some sort. There's a, this is, yes. There is a mess. There is going to be forward movement. There has been an injustice. Somebody has been lying. But the truth is very, very clear. Huh. Six of Wands reverse. No victory. This is somebody that has abused their power. Very, very controlling. Very manipulative. This is somebody that just wants to keep somebody restricted. They want to keep somebody confined. But that obstacle is now being removed. There is freedom. Because that is freedom. Freedom to go in another direction. Somebody is being broken free from a situation that, you know, has not brought them balance, has not brought them justice. You know, they're being broken free from that situation. Going down a new path. I mean, that's a two of wands. That's making a choice. Somebody is making a choice. Right now, this could be a spur of the moment decision could be a sudden decision. A decision is definitely being made. Do you do I go this way or do I go that way? So there's two sides, obviously, with this one and this one. There's two paths. A choice is being made this month. I want to keep saying week. I don't know why, but there is a choice that is being made in, in regards to which path to go down. I do feel like we have somebody here that is has been held back. They have been held back maybe by... Um, lies. Maybe they were lying to themselves. This is a card of self. This is lies. Okay. Somebody may have been lying to themselves. Or they may have been not wanting to be held accountable for their actions because this is lack of accountability. You know, ego is here. Ego, ego. So we got somebody here that may not have wanted to be held accountable for their actions, but it's like now this is taking the blindfold off. It's seeing things clearly. I do believe there's some sort of clarity that is coming, and there's a new doorway or a new path that is that is somebody's at that crossroads where they have to make a choice as to which way they want to go, and they're going. There's been indecisiveness, but I feel like the decision is going to be made to remove an obstacle this week and make that choice. So yeah, this is a week. This is the week, or the oh, damn it! I keep saying week. It is what it is, right? I meant to say month. This is the time when the decision is made um, to go and remove that obstacle. And the obstacle could be fear. It could be fear. Somebody has definitely been treated unfairly. You know, they didn't get what they deserve. And I do believe there is some sort of challenging information that is coming. You know, where there's a spur of the moment decision that is going to be made. There is an opportunity for success here, but it will require action being taken. Anyhow, I do see movement. I see positive movement forward. And you need to have faith because, and, and have faith. I mean, here's, this is the only love card we have. Stay optimistic about your love life. A positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. I think that's what it says. Yes, it does. So if you think positive, because your thoughts become things, if you wish for it and you want it, you will get it. But with the Magician card, you will have to shed the old to bring in the new. And it's funny, at the beginning, remember I said get rid of this? I think you are going to be shedding something that is uh, keeping you stuck, that is keeping you tied down, that has been controlling you. 
and I think that you're removing that obstacle and you're totally removing that obstacle or that obstacle is being removed it could be being removed by the universe you know what has some kind of obstacle is being removed that allows you to go down a path okay and this is a path this is this is success Okay, this is this is uh, triumphant news arriving, that, and, and it leads to success, and this is success as well. So you are going down a path. This is exciting, and things can happen really, really, really fast. But you just have to stay optimistic. You have to, and you have to have positive thinking, and you have to have faith. And you, this is you, have to take action. You're going to have to take those steps. You are going to have to take those steps. Good luck.